Hey guys, today I'm going to talk about these male servo leads, little pins in the so inside, male pins, and uh, I'm going to try to talk about how to remove this hood on top. I was looking online and couldn't find any information other than on the RC Group's uh, webpage. Somebody said just pry underneath here on the hood and with an X-Acto knife, which I don't recommend. Or use a small jeweler screwdriver and I wasn't having any luck with that it's prying away and couldn't figure it out um, these particular servo leads came from uh, eBay and it was for somebody from China and uh, if you look carefully at this one here it's got the letter Z on it and a little dot in the center here and what that dot is is actually just where they inject the molten hot plastic into the injection mold when they manufacture this and uh, this letter here it may vary from connector to connector because this is just uh, they're doing a multiple cavity molds and and it's uh, these little letters are just uh, if they're having an issue with a cavity they can decipher right away uh, which cavities having an issue or whatever anyways enough of that but uh, so I was trying to figure out how to remove these hoods and uh, so you gotta go on the letter side on this particular hood and I was trying with this jeweler type screwdriver you know the dollar store type and um, no luck couldn't get it off so what I found that works really well is just a small electronic screwdriver it's a, a little bit of a wedge regular flat blade screw small screwdriver and uh, if you go about two-thirds of the way down pry it in there comes right out just like that and I found this kind of screwdriver just the best thing to do don't even try with an exacto knife the hardened steel blades is not what you should be prying with um, so basically uh, to remove the pins I I'm working on a quadcopter here I just want to remove uh, the red and the black wire you guys probably already know this part but uh, you just take a small little jeweler screwdriver and get underneath the one pin that you want to remove just gently hard to do in front of the camera but gently pry that up in fact sometimes I do use a, an exacto knife to do this part so you just carefully pry up the plastic and it's hard again to do it in front of the camera but it just slides out like that and that's it that's all you gotta do anyways hope that helps you out have a good day